Right, so to sum you up, this is the octocopter. Uh, it flies all right in uh, 2.9.1b. Uh, I've now installed 3.0 uh, RC5. So we'll give it a go and see how it looks. But before we do that, I'm gonna have a drink. A lovely day on the newly mown field. Lots of bloody insects though. Hate the buggers. No pun intended. So, here we go. Um, I've done all the calibrations, the magnetometer, the accelerometer, uh, PIDs, etc. So, should be interesting. Just arming now. Running Joy Planner that Arthur made. Should be interesting. Hey, as you hear, it's armed. Okay, that's strange. For some reason I've lost my GPS lock after taking off. And it's also having a tendency to try and yaw to the left. Okay, I've got my GPS lock lost back. GPS lock. Lost my GPS again. So that's the problem with 3.0. I seem to be getting much worse GPS lock than I was originally. I'd usually get 8, so I'm now only getting 5. There we go. 6 satellites, so let's have a look. Okay, really this problem of it yawing to the left is repeating itself. It's kind of strange. Okay, so I'm going to try switching to loiter. See how this goes. Okay. Uh, if you look, it's bumping and now it's flying into the side. <laughs> so, something's up with loiter. Not working properly and it keeps yawing to the left. I'll try loiter once more. In loiter. Okay, <laughs> not staying in loiter. So yeah, there's something wrong with loiter. So, don't know what that's about. I'll just bring it back and check everything's alright. Disarming. Disarm. Let's give it another go. I have a feeling that Loiter is not going to change just from the prop spacings, unfortunately. Another thing is the throttle band is now much lower. Like uh, it took me moving the stick up quite a bit before it throttled, but now it's pretty much off the dot, which I like. But yeah. So now I'll try some fast flying. Yeah, that's all right. Let's try a landing. So one thing I noticed is the pits that were good for this uh, in 2.9 are actually too high in 3. Don't know if that's anything but it seems to be a problem. Ruddy insects everywhere. <laughs> but um, as far as holding itself still, apart from the drift from the wind, it's doing a pretty darn good job. So let's go for altitude. Okay. Seems to be handling itself all right at altitude. So I'll bring it down. Quite a slow affair.
Again, it's yawing to the left, which is not good. It's always a pity that it takes so much longer to land than it does to ascend. Okay, now I'm going to go and land it in the middle of the field, walk up to it, and then I'll do a spiral stand. This is one of my favourite moves. Should be interesting. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> So what happens on grass with short landing gear? <laughs> okay. Power it back up. Uh, should I say arm it? <laughs> okay, I've now got eight satellites, nine satellites. So I'll try um, doing the loiter again. Okay, so I'm going to switch to loiter now. Okay, yeah, it was just falling out of the sky. Not good. Let's try it once more. So I don't know what that's about, why it thinks it can do that. Let's try again. Uh, what I'm actually doing right now is adjusting the eye in loiter. Okay, so eye's been lowered. Still causing issues. Uh, I'll now turn I to zero. Let's add that now. Let's try loiter again. Okay, so nothing. Hmm. Okay, well, loiter's not working. We know that now. Right, it's not working for me. So let's try my maneuver that I love. So I'll get a bit further away. And now for the spin. I absolutely adore this move. Whoa, okay. It doesn't like yawing for some reason. And it is, there's something wrong with the yaw and the three. And the sunlight's a bit of a problem. So I can't really go as fast as I like to go. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is bring it back and actually put the camera on the copter so you can see what it looks like from the air. And you'll probably tell when I switch to loiter from the incredibly bumpy uh, moving. So, disarming. Disarm. Okay. Uh, it's set up on a camera gimbal uh, that is enabled for stabilization. So let's see. Be interesting to see the performance with 3.0 and the camera gimbal if it's any different. So it's now on. Goodbye. <laughs>
fellas, because I hear snapping again, or slapping again. Yep. This is what you get for buying the frame off of Hobby King. Don't. <laughs> or at least don't buy the Optocopter. It's terrible. Coming!